This yeah. movie is uh, it's very loud. Um, I, a lot of the movie takes place like you know I inside. So uh, most of our time spent, we were in Baton Rouge filming on a stage, and then we had two months in Vancouver. But I mean, the, this Breaking Dawn's very like intimate, and um, I just feel like they did a, a really good job at allowing us to just I don't know be creative and just be able to just be with each other. And we really didn't have to focus on you know being distracted and anything like that on this movie. They protected us. <laughs> kind of. <laughs> Hi, right here. Um, this question's for Kristen. I feel like Breaking Dawn was such an emotional journey for Bella. You got the honeymoon, wedding, getting pregnant. What was, how did you, what was it like filming for months and how did um, everything that was happening to Bella kind of affect you personally? Um, everything, I, I, I can't draw a line between myself and stuff that I do. I, 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 it's funny, I don't wanna make it um, sound like it's not just about this, but really with everything that I do, it's hard for me to take myself out of it. Um, so, uh, I'd been building up to these moments for four years. I was 17 when I started doing this movie, and um, this one really is loaded with those really cathartic, impactful, huge life moments, and they're not all completely fantasy. They're really, you know, <coughs> very rooted in a reality that I can completely see myself in. Um, and anyone, anyone who reads the book could, could, uh, could imagine. And um, sh shooting the scenes, I had to kind of let myself realize that these moments will find themselves naturally and I can't let the book, you know, punch me in the face every morning to wake me up and like give me stomach aches. It's not, it's, you have to, you know, let the moments happen. And they did and I tried to, you know, we just sort of yeah. went for it. And, and a lot of it, um, I do feel like it's very, very close to the book and um, really sincere telling of the story. But at the same time, we sort of added like bits. There are surprises that surprised me too in the more iconic bits, like the, in the wedding and the mm -hmm. um, at the honeymoon. And mm -hmm. right. Yeah, lot, lots of things. I think the thing that amazes me is that there's no bigger fan of Twilight than Kristen. I mean, it, it oh, is. She, no, it's true. Like it's you are, I mean, you're. It's, you're approaching it as an actress, as you, the way you described it, but also it's like she's always there like, I know what it felt like when I read this the first time. And it's like pushing, pushing, pushing to make sure she was capturing that feeling. And that, it, that was really, I mean, you I did put like that pressure so, on yourself. I feel like this is such a self-conscious answer, but like, ugh, yeah. No, yeah, but yeah. it's true, yeah. yeah thank you. <laughs> uh, I have sort of a nerdy question for Bill Condon. I yeah. apologize in advance. We were yeah. sort of discussing the other day like how this movie might fit into your other work. Yeah. And we feel like there's a theme running through your films of societal repression and people sort of not being allowed to be themselves. And I'm wondering if you feel like that theme comes out in, in this movie. And, and I do. It, it would sound really pretentious to say that, but I do feel like I always hook into people who are outsiders in some way, who are yearning. And it, all these characters are. You know, Jacob is yearning all the time. And, and, and both these other two to like find a, find a way to like lift, live the lives that they were meant to. I, I, I won't say anymore, but yeah, I do, definitely, yeah. Okay, cool, thanks, thanks. So. Do you personally have a favorite scene in the movie? I'm sorry, what was that for? What, what was that? I didn't thanks hear that. Uh, do you, you have a favorite, favorite scene, scene in oh, the movie? Oh, favorite scenes, right? What's your favorite scene? Um, boy, that's a good one. Because I have a lot of them, I got I know that sounds like I've when, always yeah. been able to choose one for really? all of the movies. I was going to say, Taylor's going to have a favorite right, for sure. Right. Yeah. No. I'm, d I'm about ready to let you down. I'm so sorry. <laughs> I was going to say I've always been able to choose one for every single movie. I know. But this one, I can't. I, it's just, there's, <laughs> I don't know, there's so much going on in this movie, and all of the characters are dealing with their own little things. I, it's, it's impossible for me to choose, like, right. my favorite scene in this movie. Especially, I mean... Jacob changes so much from, from the beginning to the end, so I mean, it's, it's hard for me to choose, like, I don't know, right. it's weird.